say that it feels right Hey guys, Mr. Matrix here, welcome back to another Minecraft episode, and today we are going- well, I didn't expect it to be night that quick, but we are going back to the nether. That's right, we are going to face the very thing that killed me in the last time I visited and I was scarred for life, and so much so that it's been uh, quite a while since the last time we have uh, visited the nether, but I changed the living room, I think it was gonna be that room right there, I changed it into a brewing slash enchantment room because I figured that would be a much more useful room than a living room that I'm probably never gonna visit. And plus that top floor right there kind of is a living room, I just really haven't finished it yet so I'm probably gonna count that as a living room. That's my storage room which I've added some chest in but haven't moved anything out yet. So today we're gonna explore the nether, um, we, oh I was like how do you get in this thing, I forgot you climb in the top, that's right, that's how long it's been since I've been down here i forgot how to get my own little pyramid thing which i have no idea why i made i think i just got bored all right so let's venture into the nether um oh yeah i think i was supposed to complete the walls and the ceiling but i kind of forgot to oh boy whoopsies my fault there but yeah i got everything i need i think i got a bow we got some arrows um i'm also going to try and get the return to cinder trophy not that it's anything important just will be um kind of special at the end if I can manage to get that. We got some food. Um, I think I marked the trail with cobblestone if there was a trail to get to, to there. I don't remember. It's been that long. But yeah, if you guys don't remember, I died um, last time from getting shot off the edge of the fortress from a wither skeleton. And of course, I've already raided some of the chests there. Uh, what? What? Obsidian? Um, okay. I got some free obsidian. <laughs> I don't know where that came from, but that's really weird. It didn't come off of the por portal somehow, did it? Oh boy, that's not weird at all. All right, so it looks like I marked it with andesite instead. Um, wait, where's the? Okay, so I didn't put cobblestone on the rest, but I did put torches down at least. So let's go ahead and go down and down and down. Let's revisit my worst nightmare ever. Let's also go ahead and get some of this uh, quartz. Is it? Because I know I'm gonna use it eventually. And also, you guys might have noticed I'm not using my diamond pickaxe. I put that away. Not taking any diamonds with me because I took some last time. And I think I even got some last time from the nether fortress. And I died. Yep, I died. Alright. Oh, there's a giant hole right there. Um, I, I just thought to myself I should have brought some water. But water doesn't work here. Is there lava? Yes, there is. But down low. Alright, so let's go get some of this nether quartz. Because I know I'm going to need it. And I don't want to come back here if I don't have to. Alright. So, so yeah, today we're just gonna uh, re-venture, re revisit the nether, re-venture, um, and just get some stuff, like, just get everything again. Um, like some glowstone, for example. I don't, I think I'm off the wrong path here, because I don't see any torches. But it doesn't matter. Uh, I don't really remember where the fortress was, but uh, let's get some glowstone and then worry about where the fortress was, because I kind of don't want to be there right now. Alright, uh, oh boy. I am kind of going into this blind because I haven't been here in so long. Okay, so now, and let's get here before the gas get here. Um, let's get some more of this stuff so I can pile up because I don't want to use wood. I don't want to waste the wood if I don't have to, you know what I mean? And Because I'm kind of too lazy to break it back down and my axe is almost dead too. So let's just go down here like so. And hopefully I don't get any surprises. Okay, famous last words. Oh boy. Alright, and let's get the glowstone. Okay, if you guys didn't know, you didn't need a pickaxe or anything to break it. You can just punch it with your fist, apparently. And it's like that. It's just like glass, you know, so no need to waste a pickaxe or anything. I, don't, I see some uh, YouTubers do that, but I don't know why they do. It's just, I think, I, I don't even know if it wastes the pickaxe on it or not, but yeah, a little bit tip for me. Alright, so let's just go and pile up here a little bit more. Uh, keep an eye out for any guest. I mean, I do want gas, but not when I'm up here, so... Um, because, like, you can also get the tear eye and stuff for regeneration potions, I believe. And that will be helpful for when I, when I eventually fight the wither. I don't even know if this series will be going on that long. The, saying that I'm, like, in school and work and stuff, and Minecraft is not my full job right now, so we'll just have to see. Alright, let's go to get the rest of this glowstone here. Boom, boom, boom. A boom. A boom. And a boom. Oh wait, is that the fortress right there? 
Oh, hello, Mr. Penguin. Excuse you. Alright, so let's get some carrots in our stomach. And yeah, I think I'm just gonna skip ahead to, well, to when I am in the fortress just to save some time. And yeah, I'll let you guys know when that is. Oh wait, never mind guys, uh, back in less than a second, a guest appeared. Now I don't I don't think I'm gonna get the regeneration portion because it's like swimming in the lava here. Uh, but I can get the Return of the Cinder trophy if my aim is on point, which is not. Oh boy, that was close. Come on, I don't know if it counts when you hit it with a bow, uh, but I'm gonna do it with a sword. Come on, I don't know if because sometimes like the trophies will come up on the screen sometimes they won't so I don't know but I know that if I hit it then I will get it even though if it doesn't come up come on guys you big baby you big baby white guys are you coming down yeah he's a chicken that guest is a big old chicken I'm not even gonna bother him anymore because he's not bothering me all right uh, which is usually a good thing but I want that trophy and also the gas here now there's torches everywhere but I don't know exactly where the path leads to oh boy I hope I don't get lost okay so it looks like it's gonna go this way so I'll see you guys at the fortress all right guys I think I have found another port the nether fortress like it like that trail was very misleading I ended up backtracking myself all, pretty much all the way back to the portal and when the fortress was right here so I don't know what all that trail stuff was for but yeah I'm just gonna keep on digging my way over there because I don't feel safe with all around all this lava and I will catch you guys when I get back there. Alright guys, we have made it. We have finally made it back to the uh, fortress. Don't ask how long it took because it did take a lot longer than what I would liked. And I, I was almost having to look up like old coordinates and stuff and look at the old video even. Try and see where the fortress was. But that is not needed because we have found it. And I'm really scared about doing this right here because the uh, gas could appear any second and knock me off into the lava and I could have a repeat of what happened before. Alright, so now how do we break into this bad boy? Hopefully we're in like a different part of the fortress because I don't remember seeing this part of the fortress. Alright, so now let's make the long and annoying journey up to the top. And yeah, see what we can find. I hope to find some horse armor. Well, not that it's really needed. I think I've already tamed the horse. Um, I hope to find some diamonds. Diamonds would be lovely. What else do you get in these things? Oh, of course, the uh, stuff to make the brewing potions and stuff like that. Like nether warts and things along those lines. Because that's really the main point, is just to get that stuff. Alright, it is very dark, so let's place a torch there. And my pickaxe is about to break, but that's okay because I got some more iron on me. I think I am going to have to make an iron trip soon. I don't re recall having that much iron. Uh, but that shouldn't be too much of a problem because I think there's an abandoned mine shaft uh, right under my house or something right near it or something like that. Alright, so let's just go ahead and make another pickaxe. Pickaxe, what do you want to call it? And then boom, boom, boom. Break you. Oh, don't. Well, I think I lost you. Bye, crafting table. You will be missed. Alright, so let's just go ahead and continue going up here. I don't know, staying on the outside is that much safer, but at least it's brighter because of the lava. Alright, so let's go all the way up here. And another plus side is that I'm getting a lot of this cool looking brick stuff, so we might build out of this later, I don't know. But for now, let's just get it all up in our pockets because we got the room for it. Alright, weather skeletons, you are my number one enemy here. Okay, so there's one right there. And there's some blaze. Um, I don't think I've explored this part of the fortress because it's not lit up. I know if I want uh, weather skeletons, I shouldn't light it up, but still. Hey, you blaze. Hello, sir. How you doing today? You gonna set me on fire? Or try to? Oh, no, you're still sitting by the fire. What the heck? I thought that was supposed to block it. Okay, so you could, do a, you could go ahead and die. Okay. Um, only two hearts. Not that bad. So that's a dead end right there. So, yeah, it's really just looking for a chest. And for, for stuff to make potions. Once I get those things, I think I'll be good. See, look, here's a chest right here. But I also saw... Yep, there you are. Hello, guy. Are you going to charge me down now? No, I don't even know what's on the other side. Okay. Nothing but open this. Hey! I gotta get to you. I gotta kill you before I get the chest, apparently. Oh, I thought we were going to be friends. No. Okay. He didn't attack me at first. I thought we were cool. But no. <laughs> he decided to attack me anyways. Alright, so let's go and see what's in this chest, but first, coast is clear, coast is clear, okay, coast is clear, man, so many turns right here. So we got some gold horse armor, 
and some flint and steel. Oh, I should have brought some just in case if something happened. So good thing there was some in there to the uh, portal. Alright, so I'm also going to need to get some blaze rods for the potions and for the eyes of enders to make them. Alright, and I don't have any right now. Um, I also picked up some more quartz and glowstone on the way to try and find where this place was. Um, I'm also going to place a torch like right next to it to the chest so I won't be doing that every time um okay so let's go down here it looks like there's another chest here and yeah it's always exciting exploring the nether for some reason if, if I can make it out alive that is so we got some more oh we got another saddle that'll come in handy I'll take that okay so let's just go ahead and place a, another torch right there um let's see what else okay so that's kind of a dead end right there oh look at that look at how big this fortress is though Holy mother of pearl, alright. So let's go ahead and uh, take a snack break, because all this running around is making me really, really hungry. And alright, let's see what else we can't find. Um, I guess once we get a couple more blazes and uh, find some nether wart, then we should be good to go. It would also be nice to get some magma cream. Not that it's really necessary, but um, for those fire resistance potion, is that what you use to make it? I don't know. But yeah, I think that's just all one big loop around here. Okay, so let's go up these stairs to see what we have here. And we got a little magma cube. Alright. You're not gonna drop anything for me. Dang it. Alright. So, now, I don't have that many more torches left, but I think I can make some more. Uh, I, got, I can't make that many more, but I can make some more. Okay. Oh, well, here's the uh, warts stuff. I also picked up some soul sand, so we don't have to worry about that leave the soul sand here okay and let's go ahead and take all these here okay and let's hopefully not lose it this time and let's see oh look another chest good thing I didn't go upstairs because I would have missed it all right anything oh look another chest oh two diamonds now let's see this is exactly what was happening last time I was getting all this really good stuff and then BAM I got killed I got dead I got uh, destroyed so um, I'm really hoping I don't do that this time. Uh, okay, it's a close- okay, I thought you were an enemy, but you're just a friendly pig man. As long as I don't hurt you, you don't hurt me. Um, we can add four to the mysterious- t we can add- yeah, we can add four to the mysterious two I just got earlier, so. I mean, again, I don't know how that happened. I don't know how I got two random blocks of obsidian, but now we got six. We can almost build another nether portal to get back. Um, so- Let's see, I got diamonds, I got nether wart, uh, blazes. I need blazes. I need to find a blaze spawner, that's what I need to do. Um, which I don't think they're gonna be out here. Is that gravel just that's just mysteriously floating in the sky? How peculiar. Alright, um, well, I need to, f uh, let's go up here because I've not been up here and I know that there's a chance of being a blaze spawner. Okay. Yeah, that is just gravel. Hmm. Wonder how that's happened. Okay. Alright. Let's go. Um, probably should make some more torches, as a matter of fact. As a matter of fact, I should probably make some more torches. Alright. I know this is going to prevent the wither and stuff from spawning, but I want to see. And if I was doing that, then I'd come back here and break the torches anyways when I come back. Is that a deal? Alright. Um, is this just a dead end? Nope. Looks like there's some more to be uncovered. Oh, so it just loops back downstairs to there. There's no blaze. Okay. So, yeah, oh, well, here's a blaze. Not a blaze spawner, but a blaze. Oh, a couple blazes. Die, you. Okay, so it looks like I got a blaze rod. Ah, I'm set on fire. This is what a bucket of water would be really helpful right now. I wonder if you can still use it to set yourself out. Uh, well, I mean, if you can't place it, then I guess you can't set yourself out, so that's kind of a bummer. Alright, so we got two of them. I don't know if that's going to be enough. Uh, well, I know it's not going to be enough, but for my brewing purposes, I don't know if it's going to be enough. Alright, um... Well, that just leads to that dead end and over there, so let's backtrack a little bit. Um, I am glad I found a different part of the fortress, though, but it was kind of dark and hidden, so I guess I just missed it when I first came over here or something, I don't know. Oh boy. Oh boy. Blazes! B -b -b blazes Blazes! And no blaze rods. What a shame. Alright, well, we got another chance here, but we also got a wither skeleton guy. Alright, oh boy. And they're both coming at me at the same time. No! Ah, and they wither me. And you wither me. Okay, so we got some coal. 
Oh crap. Oh crap. And this is where things go to bad, from bad to worse, okay. Whew, calm down. You're alive. You're okay. You are okay. Alright. Not after this guy gets me though. And... Ah! Okay. No, 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 I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh crap, 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 crap. Oh. Oh, let's block ourselves up a little bit here. Okay. Alright guys, we are safe. We are slowly regaining health. Whew. That could have ended off a lot worse if it did. I didn't realize how weak I was there. But we are safe. Uh, we still didn't get any. After killing those two guys, we didn't get anything else, man. Oh boy. Should I just call it quits, guys? Should I head back? Um, let's go and get some more of this nether wart stuff. Why not? Uh, I might call it quits now because after that near death experience again. Um, it might be worth heading back. Oh boy. Oh boy. Looks like I can dig my way through here. Let's explore just a little bit more. See if we can find any more chests. I know I'm going to regret saying this now. And test our luck here. Why not? Looks like we got some... Well, we already got a stack. We're not going to need more than that. Uh, place a torch there. Okay. Uh, we don't even have enough to place a stack. So, that's kind of good, I guess. Got more than we need. Um, hmm. Yeah, let's go back. I think I'm ready. Like, if there's anything else to explore in this corridor, court corridor, I think I will. But after that, I think I'll be good to go. I think I don't want to risk my life anything more than I have to. Oh, look. Look at all this new area stuff, though. Oh, boy. This is old. But, uh, right here is new, I think. I should really be saving these torches. I don't know why I keep... Wasted him. Hey, Skilly Bob. What are you doing here? Okay. That, is that the best you got? Is that the best you got? Uh, okay, you suck. Oh boy. Uh, looks like I've got a gold sword, another saddle, uh, some more nether wart that I don't need. Lots of gold stuff today. Okay. Uh, I think there was a part downstairs I could explore too. <laughs> but to be honest, I think I am good to go. Let's just explore that downstairs part because I think that's where I have to head down anyways to get out of here so let's just go do that while not oh hello buddy I can't sprint so I'm gonna have to fight you good thing you can't sprint either or otherwise I'll be toast uh, bones I guess yay I don't know oh wow I didn't realize how quick my food supply went down oh boy I should have brought a little bit more um Mariana carrots e yeah I should probably go because of my food supply if anything else oh boy oh what we got uh lots of gold stuff that I don't need man Jeez, I don't need any gold. Okay, so... We didn't get the Return to Cinder trophy. We tried. But we didn't get it because the gas was being a big white baby. What do you want to call it? I don't know. But yeah, let's just, on my way back, get some more uh, quartz. And I will see you guys at the portal. Alright guys, we have made it out. I pretty much just dug a tunnel uh, straight from the Nether Fortress. So, I'm actually going to place some blocks to get back there. Because this, this literally leads directly to the fortress. So if I just uh, put some blocks there, put some blocks there, put some blocks there, and say to go up there pretty much, then hopefully that'll be a little bit easier than following those uh, weird torches right there. Alright, so let's head on back. Let's head on back home. Alright, uh, let's go put my stuff in, the, in another chest. Uh, hopefully it's not night, I have no idea. It probably is going to be night. Um, night and raining. The perfect combination of welcoming me home. Night and raining. Alright. So let's go to sleep. Um, then we can put my stuff up in the chest. Safe and sound. And call it a successful nether trip. And hopefully we won't have to go in there for a very long time. Because I don't feel like it. Alright. So let's go to sleep. Put my stuff up um, in the chest room then call it an episode how about that uh, in the next episode we can either like do some brewing make and uh, create some enchantment stuff uh create an enchantment room or whatever you know all that stuff and yeah we'll just go from there i guess okay so let's take my handy dandy minecart track the lazy way of getting there and yeah um i guess that was the episode so let's let's look at the final hall we got one two three four five stacks of another rack 30, 
pieces of soul sand, uh, six p obsidian pieces, 39 glowstone, 61 nether brick, four saddles, two diamonds, 33 nether quartz, well, five blocks of quartz. Uh, let's go ahead and change these into the blocks because why not? And a flint and steel that I never needed to use. Um, so yeah, at the end of the day, not a bad haul from the nether. Um, okay, so this is going to be the brewing room that was originally going to be the living room. Um, just because, like I said before, I thought that uh, brewing room would be much more useful than a living room. So that's why I'm changing it to that. And then we're going to go down here. And I also left, guys, because uh, my food supply was running low. Um, as you can tell, I already have two lamb chops left. Uh, which chest, so I didn't completely fill it in. But I have somewhat filled it in. Let's put this as my nether stuff chest. So let's go and like, keep it organized somewhat. Um, this and that could go in there. That could go in there. Okay. Uh, that could go there. This and this and this and this could go there. We got four saddles. Dang, that's pretty good. Um, that could go in there. And I guess that could go in there too. We don't need that anymore. And we don't need that. So all in all, not a bad haul from the nether for a day's episode. Um, let's go ahead and create another bow, just because I don't want to have two bows. So there we go, completely, uh, unused bow too. So, yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna do this off camera or on cam camera. Probably off camera, it's just go and fill up all these chests and, like, organize them and put signs up and stuff and enjoy the nice view of the, um, garden and old house and everything like that down there. But yeah, that is gonna be the end of this episode here. Thank you all very much for watching. And from Insta Matrix, I will see you all in the next episode. Peace out.